Rabbi Nechunya ben Hakana and Rabbi Shmuel Kohen Gadol, the Tanaim, in Sefer Atmuna, explain the idea of Vayhi ben Soha Ha'aron, that the Parsha of Vayhi ben Soha Ha'aron in Bahaloscha is surrounded by backwards nuns. And these two backwards nun represent the level of Bina, of uh, the, the 50 gates of Bina, Gematria Nun. And the journey, Vayhi bin Soha Aaron, the journey of the Aaron, represents the journey of the soul, as is hinted uh, to in the two psukim of Yaakov Avinu, Vayetze Yaakov, the Yaakov left and went out, and Vayichi Yaakov, and Yaakov lived. That the Yaakov going out refers to the journey of the soul in the beginning, as it comes down to this world from the level of Bina. And, and Yaakov lived, it is the story of, of the, the departure of Yaakov back, uh, and, the, and the, the, the journey of the soul back up to its source. Um, now, these two parshas, Vayetze and Vayichi, are parsha stumos. They're closed parshas. And this hints to uh, the idea that you have uh, a, a hidden place, something in potential for the future. The Tzorach Olamos Asidos. And the Parsha of Vayihi bin Soha Aaron actually is considered to be its own book, to be its own one of the, the books of the Torah, which then becomes six books of the Torah. In other places, it's, it explains that there's seven. But according to this, there's six books. The Bamidbar doesn't get divided by Vayihi bin Soha. Rather, it's another book inside this one book. And therefore, there's six books that, that, and he describes it as shisha gufim. So, so to speak, six bodies of work. That, that refers to the, the, goof, the gufim that the, represents different levels, different types of souls, six different types of souls within potential inside this level of, the, of bina, within the, the, so to speak, fount of souls. We know is described as Otsar Shishmo Guf, the, the fount of souls, the storehouse of souls that's called the body. So the body of work, the holy Aaron then traveling through the desert is the journey of the soul down to this world and back up as the, the Aaron would travel and rest and, and so forth. There's two stages that it would... Uh, that we say, Kuma Hashem, get up Hashem and send away your enemies. And then, and then when it rests, we say. So there's two stages to the travel of the Aaron, the, the going out to battle and the coming back and, and, and resting from it, like the two stages of the soul. Um, now, the Parsha of Vahib and Soa Ha'aron itself, only the beginning is, is Psucha and the end is is Stuma, and the end is Psucha. The beginning of Vayib and Soa is a, is a closed Parsha. Uh, uh, so I'm not sure why the end of Vayib and Soa is, is an open Parsha in comparison. But at any rate, um, that's the idea. Another, in another place in Sefer Atumun, it talks about the uh, Parsha Stuma of Yichi Yaakov, representing how when uh, Yaakov's uh, passing is a, is a very hidden high place. It's the supernal Mitzrayim. Yaakov passed in Mitzrayim. It's the, you know, Bina then is the, the Mitzar Mi, Mitzar Yam. It's the, 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 the Mitzrayim de la Ela, the higher level of confinement. It's a, the spiritual level of Mitzrayim. At any rate, another th point about the Aron is, is that it had the Torah in it. So if the Aaron is the, is the soul, is the person, the Torah that's in it is, is, is the divine that's in the soul. Like uh, it, he brings here the Pasuk by the Malach Matat, where Hashem says he's going to send his angel to, that's going to be amongst the Jewish people. And that's his messenger. 
and amongst the Jewish people. And Moshe says, no, in, in Panecha Olchim, I'll tell him. He says, I, I, I want you yourself and not your, your messenger. But in the end, Hashem says, is, refers to the messenger that he's going to send amongst the Jewish people. That's his presence in, in the Jewish people. Even if Moshe wanted a higher level, Hashem says, Kishmi Bikirbo, my name is inside of this messenger. I'm here too. In the end, in the days of Yehoshua, we see that the messenger came, at Abasi. But at any rate, it represents Hashem's presence within the Jewish people. My name is inside of you. Just like uh, we have a Nefesh Elokis, we have a godly soul. And the Torah that's within the Ark is just like, he says, just like Kineshama Besoch Aguf, just like the, the soul inside the body. So if we are messengers of Hashem into this world, like an angel, and 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 um, the so to speak, we are we are the Jewish people in this world. We have, so to speak, a messenger from Hashem, a the name of Hashem inside of us. Like we are the our own, and we have the Torah inside of us. Another perspective he gives is that there's two our own us. There was there was two. There was the our own Habris and the Aron of Torah Hashem. He says the Aron Habris actually is represented by Yosef, Yosef HaTzadik, which was an Aron that traveled together with the, uh, the other Aron that the Torah, was, the Torah was inside of it. Ye Yosef was the Aron Habris because he was at Tzadik. And he kept the Bris. He was the one who represents the idea of Shmiras Habris, of, of guarding the covenant. And therefore, Aaron Habris then is represented by Yosef. Whereas the, the Aaron of the Torah has, has the Torah inside of is a, se a separate idea. Now we have two Aronos we know. In general, we say one was made by Bitzalel, and one was by, by Moshe. Um, and one would stay in the Mishkan with the presence of Hashem, the Torah Hashem, and one would go out to battle. And uh, so here you have this idea of the, the Aaron of the Tzadikim, um, the Aaron Habris, the, that we said uh, is like Yosef HaTzadik and all, all of all of the Amir Kulam Tzadikim, all of, all of the Jewish people are considered the Tzadik. And our mess, our, our, the message is, when the Aaron travels, Hashem gets up and sends away his enemies. And um, that's the, the journey of the Aaron, that you have an ark where you have, that's the, that represents the tzaddikim. And then you have the Torah that's in there represents Hashem's presence that's within us, that, that doesn't move, that's, that's so to speak, or, or that um, is uh, uh, the, the inspiration for us in our journey uh, as well as, as our soul comes down and goes back up. And this is in Sefer Atmuna, Atmuna Gimel, Os Ayn Peitzadik.